Green flag in the air as they come around. Andy Bryan, the 28 from Fort Scott, is your leader. 17 of Mike Striggle. The Wheatland Outlaw in that second spot. Sean Strong, the 14 and third, the one of Robert Heidenreich in fourth. It is Andy Bryant, the 28 car, your leader as they come around. Battle for fifth. Now, Robert Heidenreich, the 134. As your mid-season points leader, Sean Strong, in at third spot. Andy Bryant, the 28, your leader as they come around. This time out of turn four. It's still holding on. It is still Andy Bryant, the 28 from Fort Scott, Kansas. Your leader as they come around. The 17 of Mike Striegel in that second spot. 14 of Sean Strong in third. Andy Bryant, the 28. Marches his way. Hailman rounds out your top five. Sean Strong in third, Chris Jackson in fourth. Andy Bryant, the 28 from Fort Scott, Kansas, one of the young guns in this class, your leader, former V-Mod champion, Mike Striegel, the 17 in that second spot. Andy Bryant still on the point. Striegel holds him off, but for how much longer can he? It is Mike Striegel, the 17, the Wheatland Outlaw, your leader as they come around this time in a three and out of turn four. Hailman looking to the inside, cannot shut the door this time. Mike Striegel, the 17. Mike Hailman, the 85, the 134 of a Robert Heidenreich in third, the double zero of Taylor Moore. Now Moore and Heidenreich get together. Taylor Moore into three. One more corner to take. Checkered flag flies for the 17. The 17, the Wheatland outlaw, Mike Striegel. And Jason, Justin Russell. Green flag one more time. Back on green, it's Aaron uh, Poe this time. Poe getting the advantage there in the 45. Fiddle all right on the side. Everybody made it through this time. It is the 45 of Aaron Bow. The 21, the flash, Johnny Fennewald. Fennewald and Poe battles up front. Johnny Fennewald, the flash. Look into the inside of Aaron Poe. Quite a drive going on up in the front with Aaron Poe and Pinnewell. Side by side, they race in three and four and one and two. Aaron Poe, the 45, still able to hold off the 21, the hard charge in Pinnewell. The 50 of Caden Cornell, the 16-year-old in that third spot. 
John Sheets, the eight car in fourth. The 22 of Hodges rounds out your top five. Willard. Poe came up on lap traffic now, right behind him, John Sheets. Problems for Sheets. Sheets off the pace. As Sheets pulls out, that puts Spindewall back in second. But Poe keeps the momentum. Battle one more time. Johnny trying to put the slide on him. Cannot do it this time. And the 45 of Aaron Poe, the blast to 21 of Johnny Fennewall in second. Caden Cornell, a 50 car in third. Aaron Poe still the winner after Fennewall make the diamond move. Pinnell not going to get it though. That's Kate Rennell runs third, Cox in a four spot. Now Cole Campbell up to fifth. Mellowway six, Esprit seven, Jones eight, quarter eight, ninth. Russell runs tenth. Got a ram, but he can't hold him as he comes back on him. Set him up and go again. This time around, lights goes off. Green flag comes up. We'll race it. Van Wall spinning his tires off down at the bottom. Up at the top, Aaron Pro is making it happen. Aaron Poe able to work it down at the bottom, up the top, either one. Look at that diamond cut. Poe making a race for us. chance to get it done. Finnewald, your winner. Poe second, Carnell third. Carnell, he can hear you folks. Green flag in the air this time around. And it's one and coming out of turn number two, it's gonna be the 90 of Terry Schultz. The Sedalia, Missouri native, the 16 of Kerry Davis in second, 227 of Chase Domer in third. Schultz the first to go in that 90 car. Kerry Davis running second, chased over in the third stop. These guys all try to get up there. Joe Duvall on the bottom trying to get into that fifth spot. It is still the 90 of Schultz. Here comes Davis, the 16, coming around this time. Schultz on the high side. Gary Davis, the 16 on the low side. As they come through, battle for third. It is the 21 of Lance Town, the 91 of Joe Duvall. Schultz, your leader, Davis running second. Now you got Gibbs in third. You got Joe Duvall running fourth, Comer fifth. Sixth spot is a 98 there now, Jeff Cutshaw. Running seven, Nicky Burrell in the eighth spot is Lucas Gibbs. Ninth, Donnie Feller. Round out the top ten is the car number eight of Johnny Fennewall. Terry Schultz, a 90 from Sedalia, Missouri, with the lead. 
the 16 of Gary Davis, the Parkville, Missouri native in that second spot, the 91 of Joe Duvall, Muskogee, or Claremore, Oklahoma, in third. Here comes Lance down, down the 21 from Wells and Kansas in fourth. Battle for that fifth spot between the 227 of Domer, the 98 of Cutshaw. Three wide, Donnie Feller's getting down there. As Fellers gets up there in the top 10 now. Schultz. Davis. Now the battle continues for third. Lance Town, the 227. Or the two. Joe Duvall stretching his legs up in the front now. And Duvall leads the field around. Joe Duvall is going to score a win tonight at the Lucas Oil Speedway from Claremont, Oklahoma. Duvall, your winner. Schultz will be second. Third spot's going to be Kerry Davis. Duvall, your winner. Laps. Green flag in the air. Green flag flies. It is the 94 of Kenny Carroll, the 27 of Bobby Barnett going into turn one and out of turn two. Side by side for Carolyn Barnett. Into three and out of four. First one's going in the books here tonight. Side by side, Kenny Carroll, Bob Barnett. Neither body is going to give up. Both of them will hold that lane as long as they can. Looks like the 27 of Bobby Barnett with just a slight advantage over the 94 of Kenny Carroll. On the board, but on the track, they are side by side. Coming out this time, it's going to be the Bobby Barnett. Side by side, they continue to lead up in the front, Barnett and Carroll. It is a Bobby Barnett, the 27 from Republic, Missouri. Your leader as they come around. The 94 of Kenny Carroll in that second spot. The 27 of Dobiot in third. Fourth, it is the 35 of Johnny Coates. Rounding out your top five, it is the 24. Look who's coming, Tobiot in the 27 car. Now the 24 of Gerard from Moberly, the 11 of Gideon from Ozark. As they come around this time. Battle for that second spot between the 27 of Ott. Green flag in the air one more time. It's going to be the 27 of Barnett. Your leader, here comes Toby Ott. Toby Ott into turn number three. Will he take the lead? Barnett says no, not this time. As Watch they come that. out of four. Watch that, Barnett. He went to the outside. Toby Ott went to the bottom. As Ott might get up to the inside of him this time as they go down the back straightaway. It is Toby Ott on the inside. Bobby Barnett on the high side. Out of four. It's going to be Ott. Toby, Toby Ott. Ott should have it from here on. Ott, the Wheatland, Missouri native, takes the lead away from Republic's Bobby Barnett. Gets another win.
at the Lugansol Speedway. All right, can hear you now, folks. Let's hear it one more time. Tell me on. 